It was around 7 years ago when the FBI raided my real estate event. Out of all the shocking things that have ever happened to me or seen in my real estate career, this would have been at the top, and I've seen a lot. Back when I was just a little guppy wannabe real estate entrepreneur and had no clue about anything, never having done a deal, all I knew was that if I wanted to be successful and financially free, I had to get involved in real estate. So the first thing I did was go to as many real estate meetup clubs that I could find. I think I went to one every single night for a year straight until I met someone who would be my mentor. He asked me if I wanted to do what he was doing, which was raising capital. I agreed to his proposal and came into the office for the first time when I met his boss. His boss was the most charismatic person I had ever seen in my entire life. Everyone was just drawn to him. How he stood, how he talked, the jokes he cracked how friendly he was, how attentive he was when he was talking to somebody. It was pretty amazing to watch. I only briefly met him when my mentor introduced me to him. From there, I would only see him briefly a few more times during my time there. In order to raise capital, I set up an event where I would talk about the flips we were doing. And the people interested in the flips would then talk to my mentor and partner with the company to flip. About a year into working there and right in the middle of one of my speeches, the FBI barged in. Seven tall and massive FBI agents came crashing to the door with weapons and vests. A woman sitting in the very back screamed, and everyone lost their breath. After they had come in, a shorter man with a badge hanging around his neck walked down to the middle aisle and said, Stop what you're doing. We're shutting this down. We have a warrant for your arrest. I thought they were talking about me. Not sure why. They were actually talking about our boss, who was sitting right in front of me. It turns out he was embezzling funds for his own lavish lifestyle. Everyone including myself got up and walked out while our boss stayed behind with the FBI. 